Tell us about the preparation for the final against Namur. Today we've played a match, so obviously the team will go back to camp, re, um, refocus on the preparations. We're not playing a final now, the final is on the second. We still have uh, games to go to Tanga. Then from Tanga we need to still have um, Moshi. So our preparation, I've always told you guys and my people and uh, our fans, we cannot uh, play football and thinking three matches ahead. What is important is your next match. So we need to focus on the next match, give other players an opportunity to play, uh, try and rest what we can rest, and then we are ready for, 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 for the 2nd of August. So I think we need to focus on, um, on the job at hand, which is the next match. So preparations are going very well. We saw today, I think we, um, on, on Wednesday we lost. Um, yes, it was a bad loss, but we've given everybody an opportunity to play. So um, today we came back again, we made some few changes. Again, we went and, uh, and won the match convincingly. What I'm proud about is the manner in which we've been playing as a, as a team. You know, playing very good attractive football, we're scoring goals, you know. Uh, so it's, it's exciting, you know, we just hope that uh, in the next chapter, um, they can they can take it further. Um, Champions League is only later, eh? not now. But I think if if you look at the squad, look at the team, you can see that there are positions which we need to revamp, positions that we need to strengthen. Um, but for now, we need to focus on our own players which are in the team. So when the season ends, we can sit down with the, with the technical team and agree that. Uh, these players have done well, these players have not done well, we need to release them and these are the players that we've identified to strengthen our, 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 our team for Champions League. So I always say that let's focus on what is here. Of course, in the background we've always started planning for Champions League. Don't, don't believe when people say we have not. We've started three months ago to prepare for Champions League. You know? So preparations are going very well and we're hopeful that when we get to um, around the Simba Day and all those other areas, we'll be ready to. You'll be smiling in terms of how we have uh, done in the in the market. You're asking me about the players that uh, coaches. Uh, yes. Yes, of course. The coach is giving his uh, recommendations to the club. Yes. Um, you see, when it's not broken, why why fix it? So it means that we need to add where we we are lacking. You know. It's not for me to talk about uh, technical issues, but everybody is a footballer here. Everybody knows and sees where we are lacking. So those positions, uh, you need to have some, some type of uh, consistency. You know, have the same number of players for a long period of time. Of course, you know, end of the season, three, four, five players maybe might have to, to move on, or maybe one or two might be loaned out so that you can bring in maybe three or four. That's how you move the, the football club forward. You cannot go and change now, bring 10 new players and you are messing it up. You know, so it's important that we remain focused and, and we, are, we are allowed to do what we know best, which is to manage the club.